Welcome back to Good Day. Well, you might remember this picture from last year. Little girl from Aurora got into some paint while her mom was in the other room. She's, everything's covered with paint. Well, this went viral, and it was featured on some national TV shows, but cute and silly photos also got negative reactions on the Internet. So that criticism led her mom, Victoria Farmer, to create a company built on kindness. And Victoria is here to tell us all about Doll Kind. I'm holding one of the dolls. Beautiful dolls, very Thank delicate, you. very pretty. Thank you. Uh, could be keepsakes, but the real value is the message, isn't it? It is, yes. Mm -hmm. we, we've we developed a line of three um, soft and huggable dolls, mm -hmm. um, but what makes them unique is the kindness kits that come with each one of those dolls. Mm -hmm. They come with um, 10 tokens that are meant to be given as an act of kindness, and mm -hmm. that really helps encourage kids. It's not just the, the doll that does uh. the, um, that's the symbol of kindness, it goes further and actually gives you a tangible way to spread kindness. Wow, and the to tokens here say pay it forward. Yes, to encourage the passing along of the of Okay, the act. those are the yep. tokens. Mm -hmm. And you know, why is it important to get kids at, at the doll age? to start thinking about being kind and, and having empathy? Sure, so kids are innately kind and we know that, but as we grow older, we start to kind of lose sight of what's sure. important. So we wanted to develop something that would help children maintain their innate sense of kindness into adulthood mm -hmm. while also empowering them to spread that kindness to others. That's fantastic. And also you're doing your part to give back. I know that if you buy yes. a doll, you have a donation. Yeah, so for every doll sold, we donate one to a child less fortunate. Mm -hmm. um, we do have a couple of local charities that we are partnered with. We have the Ronald McDonald House Charities of Aurora and Denver. And then we're also partnered with the Denver Children's Home. Wonderful. So you just thought of this idea after that <laughs> happened. These people were negative about your baby girl. I, I can't even believe people would be negative about a picture like yeah, that. Yeah, you know, if I, if I didn't have children, I, I would probably ask the same questions that yeah. a lot of other people did. You know, how does that happen? But it literally takes two minutes. It's, um, and wow, you know, some quietness. <laughs> well, scary. Well, you know, and it's a challenge for parents these days. You know, what do you say? And then you know, you deal with bullying. You deal with it in so many aspects of your child's life. So I love this giving back thing, Doll Kind. If you want to support this, you can find more information about Doll Kind in the Good Day section of our website. And you know what I really love? Look at these beautiful boxes. Is these pretty? Yes, they come with gift packaging, so they're ready to gift. And then ready on the, to gift. Yep, on the back side, it talks a little bit about the doll mm -hmm. um, and just kind of how we give back and, and how what nice. we stand for. Love it. Great job. Keep up the great work, Victoria. Thank you. It's so great to meet you. Thanks, Shell. Thanks for coming on. Thanks, guys. Kirk, you know what I'm thinking? This is a great way to sit down and talk to your child about bullying or totally. about all that stuff. And I love that she took what kind of turned into a negative experience and turned it into something really positive. I so agree. Thanks. I wanted to fight back in a positive way. Fight back. I <laughs> fight like back it. Po positive. That's the word. Thanks, Victoria. Love it. And your daughter's cute, by the way. I, I, don't, know what, I don't know what people boy. are saying, but that's a cute picture. <laughs>